This is it. Apparently the best game of all time in the ZX Spectrum, according to your Sinclair magazine. It's 3D Death Chase. Christ, dude, look at it. It's only an old painting, is it? Look at it. Yeah, here we go. We're off. Turn the sound down, because whiny noise pisses me off. Here we go. So it's a bit like we turn the Jedi when on the older... Uh, racing through on the bikes and through the forest of Endor. Uh, you've got to kill these guys. Dodging the trees along the way. And it becomes night time. No difference, except for the colour is slightly different. I'll tell you that it is different, but... Uh, yeah, you just get near them, shoot them. It's so basic, it's unbelievable, you know. And yet this is apparently the greatest game of all time, Spectrum, you know. This is despite the fact the magazine also, in its reviews beforehand, gave it about 6 out of 10, 70%, so... You know, there we go. Each day you go along, you get a day and a night time thing. It gets more and more hectic, more and more trees, and you get to a point where your your eyes just they they just want to explode. Bloody hell! It is quite good. It's just not the sort of game you can play a lot because my head wants to explode already. Try avoid these fucking trees. Look at them. What sort of trees are they anyway? I've never seen trees like this in real life. Come on. This is how Evil Knievel used to spend his days when he wasn't trying to jump over the Grand Canyon. Gee, cause, and that's the exciting bit. I mean, I thought I was dead for sure then. But I avoided it. Avoid the trees. So this is it. Not a lot to the game. Pretty simple. You know, a small screen. It's it's not great to concentrate on. Uh, you really need a bigger screen really to play this on. But uh, I mean, it's just, it's all right. Quick couple of minutes. Ouch. Uh, <laughs> bollocks. Yeah, I mean, it's alright. No way is this the greatest game on the spectrum of all time, though, because it doesn't say much to the machine. It's like Space Invaders. I mean, that's, a, that's a bloody good game, but it's not much, It's not the greatest arcade game ever, is it? I mean, you know. It's good. It's got a bit of gameplay. There's the challenge, but it ain't. It ain't all that. I mean, this is why games aren't like this anymore because you want more to it. And I'm dead, so I'll get about six out of ten, seven out of ten. Yeah, I mean, it's all right. But it's just so. It's just too simple. I mean, the simplest things they say are sometimes going to be the best things, but I don't think so. Not bad. You won't want to play it more than a couple of times ago. So, uh, yeah. Next game, I reckon.